Hello everyone and welcome back. This is Trizus Max with Two Lines Gaming. Thank you so much for joining us as we are busy playing Airport Simulator First Class. If you are new to our channel, please do hit that subscribe button. And if you think this video was helpful, hit the like button. If you have a question, put it down in the comments. And if you need to look for more videos, go and check out the playlist on this game. I've got a lot of videos covering a lot of the topics here. And uh, today we're just going to do a quick recap on the long haul uh, flights that we we did recently. We did a preparation video. It's a little bit longer than this one, but I'm going to try and keep this short uh, to help some of our viewers that don't have the luxury of data. All right. First things first, people, we're going to want to upgrade this runway all the way to the top there. In the right hand corner, you can see small, uh, short haul, medium haul, and long haul we did upgrade that i do suggest that you upgrade the asphalt and the wear resistance to the maximum as you can see i am not there yet all right other than that you're going to want to make sure that your flux and your taxi network has been upgraded that is going to make sure that the wear is not going to go down too quick and you are going to want to upgrade these markings here which i see i haven't upgraded to the max yet so I'm going to do that while we are busy. That's very, that's a lot better. These markings are going to make sure that the traffic is going to flow quicker. By now, you should have your uh, air traffic control tower. You're going to want to have a lot of fuel, a lot, a lot of fuel to make sure that you can keep up with what is needed for this large haul or long haul flights. And then obviously the services, you're going to have to make sure that all your service vehicles are upgraded to the max to make sure that you don't have any delays that includes uh, any of your uh, catering vehicles your inspection vehicle and obviously you need to upgrade that uh, fuel vehicle of yours other vehicles that you are going to need is obviously um, the stair truck to make sure that your uh, passengers can get on and off with the baggage you're going to need baggage trucks and then obviously with uh, the big planes you're going to need a pushback truck so by now you should have all of these things make sure to upgrade it to the maximum so that you do not have problems but again i can't say how important it is to have your fuel tanks upgraded so you can have a lot of fuel these planes take a lot of fuel all right and then on the inside uh, we quickly covered that you're going to need the uh, baggage carousels. Um, I suggest having at least one for each ramp, okay? And then your international security checks. You're going to want to make sure that your check-in points are maxed out so that you don't have any delays with people coming in and out. And then obviously with your boarding desks, your boarding desks, uh, there, your boarding desks have to be up to the max. The amount of passengers that come through these planes are ridiculous. You can expect anything from 300 upwards. That's a lot of passengers, uh, maybe as much as like two or three of our medium haul flights sometimes. All right, everybody, I think we've covered most of it. If you've done all of those things and you have built your ramp and you have put in your uh, check-in desk uh, this is going to be these ones then you should be ready you're going to go over here to your uh, airlines unlock and you're going to go and check here at your biggest fl flights alpha airlines is going to be the first one that's going to be unlocked and away you go all right we rumbled through a lot there so if you feel that was a little too fast uh, please check the video again or I really do suggest go and check the time that I've put into the uh, big video. Um, it's called uh, Preparing for Long Haul. And yeah, it's going to help you to get up to this stage. It's so cool to check this big plane. But I look forward to hearing from you guys. And we'll see how far we're going to go with this airport. Until next time, bye-bye.